If you own a website or you're an SEO professional or a digital marketing agency, even an e-commerce manager, then it is your responsibility to make sure that your website is fully indexed in Google so that you can benefit from all of that free traffic. But how do you make sure that happens? Well, that's where this software comes in. And right now at the time of doing this video, they have a lifetime deal for a very short time. You might want to click the link underneath this video and go and check them out. So what does it do? Well, you can take all of your URLs and you can mass index them safely. Uh, you know, instead of going to the Google search console and kind of putting in one URL at a time, then it can help make sure that your site is fully indexed and, and as I say, then able to benefit from the free traffic. So in this video, I'm going to show you how it works. And I'm going to do one of my own websites because the other thing that it can do, which is vitally important, is if you have a page that's currently getting you visits from Google and it just drops out overnight, which does happen without a doubt, then you're going to be the one who just doesn't really understand why you're suddenly not getting sales and traffic. And it's because your page disappeared. So this can alert you to the fact that that's happened and get you to come back and then re-index it for you again. So very, very powerful software. So here we are in the back end of the software. And what I've done is to log into my Google account so that all of my websites that I have with Google Search Console are now here and available for me to use with the software. And I'm going to take this one, uh, jasonwest.com, and then I'm going to enable it just here. And then we can take a little look at the details. Uh, and we need to go ahead and grab one of these emails right here. And then we can put this as a user in the settings. So here we are, you can add a user and you can always go ahead and delete these anytime you want. We'll make them an owner and just click add like that. And this allows us to go and uh, index a couple of hundred pages. So it's highly worth while. Let's take that there and we'll go back again and we'll add another one like this. There we go. And depending on what plan you get, then you can have a uh, you know, different amount of users and so on. And then I'm just going to click check status. There we go. And then it should enable show these as active straight away. There you go. That's perfect. And I can go ahead and add these as well if I want to. But just for the purpose of this, I won't. And now we've you can see that it says it's fetching the sitemaps and it's going to start going through all of the web pages on my site and then seeing what the status is. Are they indexed? Are they not? Um, and then we can check the health of the pages. And also, if there's any anything that happens to any of the URLs that are indexed in the future, we can also set it to tell us, hey, this page is vanished by the looks of it. So um, I'll take a little look once it's finished and then we'll we'll see what it's found for us. Now that didn't take very long to do, but wow, look what's happened here. I've got more pages that are not indexed than are indexed. So, you know, that's a bit of an eye opener right there. Um, so what we can do at this point is we can uh, easily find those pages. So just by clicking on the not index just there and you can see it says status is not indexed. All of these pages are not able to get me any traffic at all from Google because they're not in Google. So it's very important that we, we fix that, obviously, as soon as possible. So I'm going to click here and just pick the maximum. There you go. Now, it's worth noting that you saw me add the users to the Google Search Console just now. You can submit 200 URLs per user just there, which gave me a maximum of 800 pages that I could submit in one go. And we can do that safely. So there you go. We can just click submit 201 pages for indexing just by pressing that button there. And now they're in the queue and then they're going to get uh, requested to Google to index those pages, which will then, of course, increase traffic. And that is exactly what you want and need as a website owner a free source of traffic from Google. Now, uh, let's just have a little quick tour about what else you can do here. Um, at the top, we can um, index emails are enabled. Look at that. So get notified by email every Monday when a new page uh, are index, new pages are indexed. So you get to see what's going on in your site. Maybe you're a blog owner, you've added some new blog posts, and then you're going to get an email that will tell you exactly that those new blog posts are in Google now. Um, and then you can get notified immediately, very importantly, if pages that you already have drop out of the index. So that's uh, probably even more important. 
And then you can uh, download a report in PDF format or just export uh, all the data with the current filters that are there at the moment. And then there's some more filters just down here. But yeah, I mean, you can see that only 37.58% of my site is in Google and 62% of it is not even indexed and therefore can't work for me or help me. Now, I understand that very soon they're quite active with this software. Uh, again, there's a link underneath this video if you want to make sure all of your pages are indexed in the search engines. They're also doing Bing as well uh, very soon and then adding some analytics features as well to this. So I think this is a really um, useful bit of software. Now, just further down, we can see uh, all of the pages on our site just here. And then we can see the index status. These are the ones that I just submitted. So we've got the uh, the submitted date of December 27th. And then um, basically we want to see that go green. And if we've set our reporting up, we should get an email come through to tell us that new pages have been found and are now indexed. Then if you hold your mouse over these pages, such as this one here, um, it shows you that it's been included in the sitemap that it got from the search console. Uh, when it was last checked, uh, when it was last crawled, um, which it says was back in July 23rd, and it's dropped out since then, you see. So just because your page went into Google and got indexed, it doesn't mean it's there forever. They can yank it out while you're sleeping and you don't realize, which is why this is very, very important. And I shall be putting this on all of my sites. Uh, after this video, I'll be doing the whole lot and putting it on auto index. And then uh, just here, we can see, uh, what does it say? We don't know if this page is blocked from Google. Then uh, this page has been successfully fetched by Google. And then also whether it's been crawled on mobile, you can go and have a look at it within your Google search console. And now you can also do uh, page level checks. So if you click on it, it takes a second to load up. And what it will do is it will just give you a rundown of how good your page is in terms of SEO. And here we are. Here, here is what you get back. So we can see the load time, which is always interesting, uh, the best practices, and then an SEO audit right here, uh, whether it's passed or failed, these things here, like structured data is valid. It's saying, no, it isn't. So that's something that perhaps I should look at for my website. Overall, the SEO score is actually quite high. Um, in terms of probably the, the text on there and everything. And most things are correct and ticked, so I guess that's quite good. But if it's not indexed, as I say, it'd be it's absolutely useless. So I think this is a great bit of software. You've got support as well right here, which I found very quick. There was a, a brief issue in linking the uh, software to my Google Search Console. It was it resolved itself, actually, but I did message support and I got a response um, within just an hour or two. So that was very good, especially with it being this time of year as well. And then you can join their affiliate program if you want to promote this. You might want to after you've used it and benefited from it. They have a, a great uh, roadmap there as well and then a full manual, too. And you can also add team members as well if you want to uh, put some of your team, maybe if you run an SEO agency, um, this is going to be great for you because you can create nice reports. You can have uh, all of your customers sites in one place. So I can definitely see um, this being a, a really valuable bit of software for anybody who owns a website, but also, as I say, digital marketing agencies. But um, grab a deal. There is a link underneath this video. Go ahead and get it while it's on a lifetime deal. Imagine being able to do this permanently with no extra monthly cost. Uh, so I don't believe it's on for very long. So I highly recommend you grab the deal like I did. And thanks for watching this video. And I'll see you in the next one in just a second.